Do you have the problem of wasting time searching for the notes that you have taken? Now, if you have this problem like me before, I want you to watch this video. I'm going to show you a system how you can create a page index or we call table of content to help you become efficient and no more searching for the notes. So, Right now, we are in my OneNote. I'm going to show you this in OneNote, right? Creating a page index or table content in your notebook is like giving it a GPS. It helps you quickly locate specific notes, ideas, or whatever entries that you have done on your phone or anywhere on a PC, especially using OneNote, right? Then you don't have to go search through all your note pages or notebook. So keep it organized and then you will become more efficient. Let's jump right into it and show you how. This is the index I created and I'm going to show you. It's something so simple that you have all this, right? And you have uh, different meetings, uh, you can categorize them. Or you can just want to have just one type of index, just like normal one list of table contents, you can do that as well. So when you are set up like this, let me just show you here, right? When I click it, it will take me directly to the information. So this is the index, no matter which page or notebook it comes from, when I click, it will go to that particular page. So all I have to do is go to this index page or table of content, then I can link it to all the my notes pages. So I can click here, it will jump into my project. So let me show you how to create that. Very simple now. All you need to learn is that every page let me just go, let's say, for example, um, here, this page, right? Now, if you want to link to this particular section, all you need is just click select this. You can see this, you can select, you can move it all around. Yeah. So right click here, and then you can see copy link to paragraph. Now, once you click here, you can go back to your index page. And then you can paste it anywhere you want, right? Let me control V and paste it right over here. So you can see this. When I click it, you go back here. So this will be the title that will be shown in your index. So if you want to name it properly, then make sure that your section is titled properly. Now, to simplify, if you use it, let's say, for example, this uh, meeting, you should have named it like this, okay? And this meeting is, this particular note is for this meeting only. Then what you can do is that you can actually right-click over here at the title and then copy link to the paragraph. Go back here, okay? So just paste in whichever place you want. You can see that, yeah? So that your title of your notes will become the link. So that you don't have to go and redo anything else. There are two ways if you write to write your notes. Let's say, for example, this is uh, this particular note is for, let me open that one. Let's say, this is only for, let's say, HR meetings. So all my HR meetings will be in here. Then I can create, let's say, 202, 501, 21, and then we have these uh, meetings, HR meetings, and whatever the discussion, you write it right over here. Then you may have another one with two 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 for things. Now, if you have, I mean, if you create your note something like this, then you may need to copy directly to that section. Let's say here. Now, this is I organize in a so-called table. To insert table is very simple. Just go in here, table. So how many? You should I just like two columns because it's easy for me to see it on my phone. Okay. 
meetings right over here then you can put your link right here and you can organize it you can make it bigger smaller totally up to you okay or you just want to continue from here you can do like this and then you can table insert another row below and you can basically put like this this one you can copy and place it here you want a bullet want a format now you can create your index i like to organize it in table that uh, is uh looks nicer if you do not want you can just put hr meetings and then use paste then you have other like supply chain meeting so use the supply chain meeting i can just right click over here copy link and then i can paste it right over here also can now the beauty is that uh, OneNote is very flexible you can organize anywhere you want okay so this is how you copy and paste the page link so that no matter from which notebook right so different section even from let's say i got a project from different section here okay project okay now if you copy like this because there's no uh, this is a table so the first two words will be your title let's we'll copy this link and show you and you just put it let's say i put it right over here can see it just showed to do then it's very difficult that uh, you do not know what what link is that right so the best is that you do not have a title for this particular section then use the the title of your notes or your page copy link and then go back here All right and this is project kanban you can click and then it brings you directly to here okay now if you have any questions about this right how to organize your note do leave it comments right below now you want to make it more fancy or colorful you can always you know that this is a very important one you can highlight it and then you can choose whatever color yeah let's say this is important or make it okay yellow highlight you can do that yeah or you want to unhighlight it also can can even change the color of your fonts right so it depends on how you want to do it and uh, i like color coding it right so if you have important notes that you want to take care of right now i can just highlight it now of course if you want to organize just cut and paste right it's very simple just Let's say for example i can control x so move this to the front and then paste it okay press the space and then enter you just organize it you want to move it up and down for me the, I, I just prefer that I, I will highlight it right so the critical one maybe i'll put a red color or pink color yeah it looks good too red color yeah then yellow or whatever you want to highlight purple so Create your own color index. The best is that you share this with your team members. You can always create your color index. So each color is what meaning, right? Yellow is what, then red is what, then you can do that. So make it organized and then easy, especially if you share these notes uh, with your team members. So I hope this uh, one note page index or table of content methodology will save you a lot of time right by organizing organizing your notes in just one page now of course let's show you this is a meeting index if you want to put it depends on what kind of notes you take if you take a lot of notes then you can separate by categories if it's not just have one page index will do will simplify everything so by the way i'm andrew and if you like this type of content do share with your colleagues and friends do subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so that every week when we publish new content you'll be notified and meanwhile check out some of our videos that created earlier i hope to see you real soon in my next video